Hello and welcome back. In today's lesson I will show you what block and inline elements are. So when it comes to HTML tags, each element has its default display value and it's either block or inline. Block elements always start on a new line and take up the whole space that is available. Inline elements, on the other hand, don't start on a new line and only take up as much space as necessary. So I will begin by showing you some block elements. So for example, all the heading tags, such as h1, h2, h3, and so on, are block elements. And I will create an h2 here. And I will show you that it starts on a new line and takes up the whole space available. I will give it a style. And I will give it a border of one pixel solid red. Now if I save this and open up the page, you can see that the H2 with the high text starts on a new line. It stretches across the whole page. That's why the border is so wide. Another example is the paragraph tag. Again, I will give it a border. And this, just like the H2 or the H1, starts on a new line and stretches across the whole space. Other examples of block elements are the UL or the OL, which is the unordered and the ordered list, including the list tag. Next, I will show you some examples of the inline elements. So I'll just go down and I will add another paragraph. And I will just add some random text. And then I will add a link. I will give it an empty href just because it doesn't need to point anywhere right now. I'll give it a text of link. I will also give it a style and I will give it a border of one pixel solid magenta. So now we have the link added and um, if I save this, you can see we have this paragraph and within the paragraph we have the link but it does not stretch across the whole width of the page. The border is only around it and only takes up as much space as needed. Another inline element is the image. So I'll just go down. And here I'll add an image. I'll give it a source and I'll just link an image again I will give it a border sorry a style with the border one pixel solid green I'll break this up so you can see it better. Oh yeah, and I'll also give it a width so it doesn't take up too much space. I'll say it should be 100 pixels. If I save and reload, you can see again that the image does not start on a new line, but instead is right next to the link and it only takes up as much space as needed. Other inline elements are the formatting tags such as strong or mark or em for emphasized text. As you continue to learn HTML, you will get to know more and more of these. I will also link a list of both below just so you can have a look if you're interested. If you have any questions, please leave a comment below and I'll try to answer. In the next lesson, I will show you the header tag. If you like this video, please subscribe and see you in the next one.
Bye.